सो हेलो देयर एंड वेलकम टू द चैनल एंड आई होप यू ऑल डूइंग ग्रेट सो टूडेज वीडियो इज़ अ बेट डिफरेंट फ्रॉम माई प्रीवियस वर्नस बिकॉज आई आई विल टॉक अबाउट द चैलेंजेस दैट आई फेस अर्ली इन माई आर्ट करियर सो आई आई वॉन्ट टू शेयर माई एक्सपीरियंस इन सिंपल वर्ड सो यू कैन ईजली अंडरस्टैंड सो आई एल डिस्कस अबाउट माई three biggest challenges that i face and uh, you will see like how you will like get insights like how i solve them and i am so grateful for overcoming this problem in my career so like if i uh, tell you about little bit about what challenges so i covered in this video like first challenge was the burnout and the second was the health like uh, the physical activity and the third was the finance managing my finance personal finance so these are the issues uh, uh, which i am so uh, passionate about solving this thing so and uh, i find them very interesting so i hope you enjoy these insights like how i tackle these challenges and uh, this is not a tutorial video so it just me sharing my experience and giving you some valuable insight so let's move to the first challenge like uh, this is my most i think uh, the biggest challenge that i face in my career is like uh, and this is a crucial problem like to solve for sustaining a long term career because this is not a uh, like uh, uh, short term game so in order to sustain a long term career you need to like uh, solve this particular problem and i feel many of you face this same issue that i face like uh, burn out like first of all you need to understand this is a natural and uh, thing and why i say this is natural because uh, like in any career uh, if you put it the time like like give it so much time and uh, it becomes like boring and tedious and like if you do like for a long time feel burn out so when you do like something for a long term uh, burnout can happen so please don't like embarrass yourself like i face burnout often when i started my career because uh, i was doing too much thing and like creating artwork and learning things and uh, like managing my like many tasks so i felt loss because at the end of my day like i haven't finished anything else so my first suggestion was like plan your day like pick your top 2 or 3 most important task that you want to do uh, like you want to finish that day so and be realistic like don't add too much task uh, in your to do list so that helps uh, helps you a lot because it's really prevent like uh, prevent like frustration and burnout thing so planning your day it's really help you to like uh, maintain your like mental health and like burnout thing this is how i manage my schedule and avoid burnout i hope this gives you some insights into like how i handle burnout thing so now let's move to the second challenge which is like managing my health physical health and the second challenge was i know this sounds silly but 
बट माई सेकेंड चैलेंज वॉज लाइक मेनटेनिंग माई हेल्थ नॉट जस्ट फॉर लाइक वीक और मंथ आई वॉन्ट टू मेनटेन इट फॉर रियली लॉन्ग पीरियड ऑफ टाइम लाइक सो यू नीड टू लाइक बिलीव दैट दिस इज अ लॉन्ग टर्म गेम सो एंड वी नो दैट हेल्थ इज इम्पॉर्टेंट लाइक मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट थिंग इन आवर लाइफ सो एट दैट टाइम आई नो हेल्थ इज इम्पॉर्टेंट बट आई कुडेंट फाइंड a way to like maintain my health uh, so i just sit for a long hours and just uh, draw and this really bad for my health and so i suggest you to add some type of physical activity to your daily routine uh, it's not just for a week or a month you need to do it for a long like long time and uh, if i give you my example i really struggle with like going to the gym or doing exercise daily so i ask myself is it necessary to like work out for one or two hours every day like is it necessary so after watching bunch of youtube videos and after uh, and i realize that you don't need to work out uh, like long hours uh, if you don't have like a habit to like uh, exercising like daily so you just need a habit that suits your nature like i mean is that uh, just start with small so just go outside for like 10 minutes every day and uh, this is uh this is how i started like my fitness journey and uh, like going out for like 10 minutes is better than like going to the gym for 1 hour once a week like just uh walk every morning or uh, like every evening for 10 minutes maybe 5 minutes if you really like you hate like going to the gym or doing any physical activity just go uh, outside for 5 minutes just walk and this help uh, this helps uh, you a uh, build a habit for like walking and running and uh, trust me once you started eventually you want to uh, like you may want to do more like i just started with the like simple thing like 5 minutes of walking and or uh, like 10 minutes of like walking and now i play football for an hour with children every single day without feeling any burden so this is my way to manage my like physical health like i started with small thing like uh, i just go for like 10 minutes of walking and now i play football for an hour with children like without feeling any burnout or like without any burden so this is like my way to manage my physical health and i hope you get some insights like how i manage my physical health and so yeah so let's move to the final uh, uh, like part of this video uh, like uh, Uh, which i face like managing my finance so let's talk about that so one of like my biggest struggle early in my career was managing my finance like nowadays i really passionate about like managing my money and investing and uh, if you are in your early 20s or even younger i strongly suggest you to start investing 
uh, I might sound like advice from uh, like a mentor or a guru but trust me understanding how compounding works uh, is amazing so the earlier you start investing the more uh, wealth you will create by the time you are in your 40s or 50s like start with a small amount it doesn't matter what uh, uh, what amount you invest uh, what matter is like how uh, like how uh, time period you invest like for example uh, i began my investing journey about a year and a half year ago like i with just 20 dollars now i invest around like 2500 dollar per month it's really important to start as early as you can also try not to spend too much like when you are younger you want to buy like uh, latest like gadgets and like unnecessary thing which you don't need so like start saving as much as you can because uh, you are in your golden period like uh, in your 20s it's like a golden period so just uh, start saving your money but instead of like just uh, saving money in a bank account like consider investing in an index fund like the S&P 500 this fund can give you an annual return of around like 12 to 13 percent or maybe 15 percent which is great for beginners i started earning money when i was 20 years old but uh, uh, didn't as a start investing until a year later like it's never too late to begin so start with small and uh, increase your investment amount like over time so yeah i hope this uh, advice helps you and uh, yeah that's it for this video and i hope you enjoy this video and thank you so much for your support uh, it really means a lot to me so yeah see you in the next one until then take care bye bye